Act. I play the trombone, and in 2008, I won the BBC Young Musician of the Year competition, which was a fantastic experience and a real honour to win. Peter was only 12 years old when he won the BBC Young Musician of the Year competition. This is a very important national competition for musicians under 18. One of the competition judges was Nicola Benedetti. Peter comes from a very musical family. Music was very important when I was young. My parents were both professional musicians and I grew up listening to music all the time. My mum and dad were both horn players um, in orchestras and my brother plays the trumpet and my sister plays the piano. Peter was interested in music from a very young age. I first started to read music when I was about six years old. My dad started teaching me trombone when I was seven years old. And I started playing the piano a year after that. Today, Peter lives in Manchester with his family, but he wasn't born here. I was born in Northern Ireland and moved over to Manchester when I was eight. I started at Cheatham's when I was nine in 2005. Life at Cheatham's can be hard work, but Peter enjoys it. And he doesn't play the trombone all the time. The best thing about being at Cheatham's is the musical opportunities that you get. At school, I can play in many different ensembles, orchestras, jazz bands, brass bands. I think my favorite is jazz band. When I'm not playing music, I like to relax and play sport like football or tennis. I support Manchester City Football Club and go to see the matches regularly when I have the time. Peter is young, but he is very talented and hardworking. And with the help of the teachers at Cheatham's and a lot of practice, he can become world famous in the future. Uh, so guys, please, we will have this exercise rated very well and we will have the discussions later in Google Meet. In addition to this exercise, I'll assign each one of you a word. You have to find out this word from the video and put this word in a sentence, in a full sentence, whatever, whether it's f from the video or from, from, from your, your own. That means the word must be connected to the video and must be not as simple as you find. Better be connected to music. Okay, so please pay attention to that. Adkum, تحلون هذا التمرين راح نقل الحل أريد إن شاء الله بالجوجل ميت. وعدكم كذلك تعطوني كلمة مرتبطة بالميوزك. تخلوها بجملة إذا كانت الجملة من داخل الفيديو أو إذا من خارج خارج الفيديو من عدكم وريدها جملة متكاملة يعني جملة هذه من واحدة تختارون اثنين أو ثلاثة مجزمم ثلاثة يعني ثلاث جمل ثلاث كلمات عدنا عدنا vocabulary and listening actually it depends on for example, noun with noun, noun plus noun. That means two words compound with noun plus noun. For example, book, bookshop, motor, see, you can find motor, motorbike. Because this is noun and this is noun. They are not verb. Sun. Sunglasses. Living. Living room. Noun, noun. Bus. Station. 
hand handbag railway station since we have two a x x2 yeah that's mean two times we can select car you can see car park traffic lights petrol we have station okay here station sorry and bus we have to put bus within bus stop sorry bus stop not station okay since we have now we have with the station so only we change the bus to stop and then need to test to other students or the noun that go to go together for example this is where we buy books a bookshop so mean we have to describe noun to noun also we will have discussions through Google Meet I need you also give me each one of you give me compound two noun come together just like this example and put them in sentence full sentence and let's let us 5.14 listen to this tape script tape script 5.16 sorry prepositions tape script 5.14 Noun plus noun. One. Excuse me, is there a post office near here? Yes. Can you see the bus stop over there? Yes, I can. Well, it's next to the bus stop, near the traffic lights. Thanks. Two. I can't find my sunglasses. Not again. Look in your handbag. Where's my handbag? It's in the living room. Oh, yes, there it is. And there they are. Three. Excuse me, is there a petrol station near here? A petrol station? Yeah. Go past the railway station and the car park. It's just before the motorway. That's very kind. Thank you. Okay, guys, so also we have motor. We said here motor. And this one motorway. Okay, please pay attention to this. And what we said regarding motor. And some nutty glasses, actually, I'm sorry. Motorway. And for the second time, motorway and this one car park motor station so whatever okay and please give me the answers here for this tape script through Google whatsapp whatsapp 